What's up everyone to another plug-in review by me Florian Rugala on my channel Beats Basteln. Are you making funk beats? Because in that case I got you covered with this new funk synthesizer plug-in that has just been released. It is called LBZ by Lorenz Bolz. It has this really unique design with a bunch of rabbits and even beers, two families together on a trip, maybe on their way to a picnic. They could have their stuff in there to have a nice chat about the latest weather conditions and shocking news like whatever the neighbors lately did which was slightly unexpected. Of course this fits perfectly into the funk narrative because you know after a long day of hustle culture watching hundreds of Andrew Tate videos and illegal street drifting footage of people doing drift tandems you just need to unwind with a few rabbits and beers obviously. Now let's talk about the parameters of this plugin or should I say parameter because this plugin in is a one knob and as you've just heard it is a cobble synth so this is the plugin that you instantiate on your tracks if you need a lead synthesizer in a funk beat the single knob is in the center of the interface and it plays a cobalt sequence. You can change the notes in the sequence. This is quite limiting, but at the same time, it is also a nice workflow. It is fast and easy, no need for scales, no need for keys, no need for music theory, no need for Unison Audio MIDI sample packs, just beers and rabbits having a good time. It is an unusual choice for a sequencer GUI. Typically there is a grid for placing events like in a piano roll, but this is much more intuitive. You just have to turn it. Now here's an interesting design choice that has been made that is not present in a lot of plugins out there, which is that this is actually an endless knob. You can turn it 360 degrees and it just goes on from there. And you can repeat that endlessly. The only other plugin where I have seen a mechanic like that so far where it really made sense was in Image Line Harmor on the phaser. Now why did they decide for a continuous knob you might ask? The reason is the BPM of the sequence is defined by the rotation speed of the knob. This gives the synthesizer a more natural and organic feel. But I do gotta wonder, Lorenz, why did you not add a tempo sync button for those who just wanna slap it on a track and let's go? That's definitely something that I would add in a future version of this plugin. Also, you should note that you can also turn this backwards to reverse the sequence. As you might have noticed, this does not reverse the audio that is being played, but the MIDI sequence. Now let's talk a little bit about the sound quality of this plugin. It is a physical modeling engine, which kind of models the behavior of a real cowbell or bells in general. Yeah, I don't know how exactly it works in the background, but I do gotta say, when you are playing it in reverse, there are sometimes these very nasty resonances and I think I should fix them in post with some SOOF2 when I use this plugin in practice. It's not entirely clear why it happens. Likely it is part of the award-winning physical modeling cowbell engine. The website says this plugin is almost like real life though, so it must be true. All right, everyone, I prepared this super detailed funk beat. which I totally didn't make by just entering a prompt into text to sample. And now I will play a sequence on top of it with LBZ. Now for some reason, even though this is a synthesizer plugin, you have to actually use your microphone to get sound out of it into your door. I have no idea why, but let's just do it. Alright, there was a sick sequence. Let's slap some ODT on it. Best funk beat ever. Now let's cut out some resonances. Perfect. 
LBZ by Lorenz Bolz. Out now! Get it a little bit cheaper with the affiliate links in the description. This month it is still on an intro sale for 420 euro, but you can also get it as a subscription for 420 euro a month.